and also from the 19 volunteers and an animal rescue pleading for the public's help oh, wow. as they care for a dog who was the victim of a cruel crime. That pooch shot several times, a bullet still lodged in her head. The night team's Franklin White is live in Southwest Miami-Dade where vets are now taking care of that pup. Franklin? That's right, that dog is just two years old and doctors fear she may have severe internal injuries because that bullet in her head, doctors say has now traveled near her stomach. They're now hoping for a full recovery. There's no words for a person that could do this to an innocent animal. With the bullet wound still visible in her head. It's horrifying to see. It's a miracle. This pit bull mix named miracle is still alive. The animal just found walking around the street with a gunshot wound to the head. According to iHeart Animal Rescue, Miracle was found Saturday in North Miami. When Miami Day Animal Services went to pick her up, they quickly realized she needed immediate medical attention. That's when iHeart stepped in and rushed her to Knowles Animal Clinic in Southwest Miami Dade. Right now, she's not stable, so she can't do surgery. Once there, the vet realized her injuries may be worse than he initially thought. What his concern is, he can see the bullet. Now the bullet went in the head, the bullet he sees it's in the abdomen, he can feel it. But the question is, what happened on the ride? <laughs> Are there fragments in there? Did it um, you know, hurt any organs in there? This is what his fear is. This is not the first time and it's becoming a problem. Their most recent problem involved a dog named Justice who was found stabbed multiple times last month in Pompano Beach. Justice also received medical attention here and made a full recovery and was recently adopted. Good girl, good girl. As for Miracle, she still has a long road ahead and currently has fluid built up and possible internal injuries as doctors work to figure out the best way to safely remove the bullet. The rescue group not only hoping for justice when it comes to finding whoever shot Miracle, but also hoping for help getting her the care she needs and the life she deserves. When they get here, they stay here, they get what they need and then they need to be going into a foster home. Her medical bills are between ten to fifteen thousand dollars in that rescue group. They need help paying for the medical bills. If you would like to help and donate, click on the story at WSPN.com to learn how. Reporting live in Southwest Miami Day tonight, Franklin White, 7 News, 19.